Uh, but Yohan Moncada going up against Casey Mize is probably not a matchup that springs out at you because if you look at Casey Mize, he's been phenomenal in the month of May. When he got called up last year, we didn't exactly see stellar performances for him, but I think we're now kind of starting to see what all that hype was about. But if there's one blemish that has come about since he's joined the majors is that he struggles against left-handed hitters. And that's kind of where I get this, uh, this spot for Moncada here. Lefties have tagged him for a 328 Wobra, 5.34 FIP, and four of the seven home runs he's allowed. Now, Moncada hasn't hit for a ton of power. So we do have to put that out there. But to, oh, look, Nick's smiling. You know, he's got a point that I brought up. But there's one thing about Moncada is that he's getting on base and he's doing well, even without the power. He's got a 394 Wolver, 157 WRC plus against righty so far this season. And he's smack dab in the middle of that White Sox lineup that is extremely, extremely tough to get out from top to bottom here. I mean, we've got guys like, you know, Nick Matterell hitting at the second spot and he's actually doing well. Like that really says something. So I think there's something really good about this White Sox lineup. I like Moncada going tonight against Casey Mize. And quite frankly, I don't think he's going to have terribly uh, high ownership because of how well Mize has been pitching. But I do like him a lot tonight. 